welcome to my couch. Almost a new month always means a new monthly favorite, so are you ready? Number one on my list has to be crumpets. I didn't know what they were, I just heard about them, and I know that you're supposed to eat them in the afternoon with tea, but I actually enjoy eating them in the morning as breakfast, so I started every single morning to eat one, and I usually like to put some cream on top because it makes just such a good mix, and it's pretty much like a pancake and a waffle together, so this is like the best thing ever, pretty much. Second favorite is a pair of shoes that I designed myself with projectshoes.com and you can actually find them online right now. I've been wearing them for the last couple weeks. They are so comfortable, they are so well made. I know that they are kind of pricey, but honestly, I'm just so happy that I got the chance to design them. I call them Daisy and you can see them online if you want to. I will leave the link down below. But yeah, moving on, another food favorite of mine is this huge furry pot that is originally by Etude House and I simply like it because I usually put it by my dressing table so anytime that I want to do my makeup I can just put my feet inside and it feels so comfortable and soft and I just love it. It's, it's a silly thing but it makes your day better. Do you know what I mean? I also have a beauty favorite this month, which is the lipstick that I've been wearing. It's by Three Concept Eyes, which is the cosmetic brand of Style Nanda, which is a Korean brand. And I think that this is the perfect summer shade because it's a nude, so you can totally wear it during the day. But it also has a bit of an orange undertone to it, so it just adds a little bit of color to your lips instead of having the usual no color. Next favorite is a TV show. It's a British one and it's not new. I think there are five seasons out, so it's definitely not new. I love it. It's called Misfits. It has a lot of violence and sex and bad language. So if you're curious and you are younger, maybe ask someone else if you're allowed to watch it and stuff like that. But it is so fun and different and all the characters are so unique. And my favorite actually is Simon, which is the weird guy. If you watch it, let me know which one is yours. But to give you an idea of what the story is about, it pretty much evolves around this group of social workers. After a huge storm, they get superpowers. And I know this sounds kind of weird, but it's really good. And now the last favorite for the month of July is a DS game called Tomodachi Life, which is a mix between Animal Crossing and My Sims. But what differs it from these two games is that you are allowed to use your own me you have your own island and you see them interact and you follow their lives and I'm not gonna lie, sometimes it can be a bit boring but overall so far I've been really really enjoying it. And that's it! All my monthly favorites have been revealed. I really hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you very soon. Bye! Thanks for watching!